Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today, I just wanted to hop on here really quickly to give you guys a look at what my Invisalign treatment plan looks like. In my last video, I mentioned something called a ClinCheck, but I never really went into detail about what it was. So that's something that I wanted to do today. Um, in this video, I will be talking about what ClinCheck is, how and why it's made, and of course, giving you guys a little sneak peek at what mine looks like. So to start off, ClinCheck is an online tool used by Invisalign and your orthodontist to work out a treatment plan. That being said, it'll look different from person to person just based on um, what your orthodontist is trying to fix, what your teeth look like, and how they'll have to move in order to get to the end point, um, the goal that you're trying to achieve with your orthodontic treatment plan. In my opinion, it's a really, really great tool that'll allow you to see what's going on in your mouth in the next few months or years as you progress through your Invisalign journey. Like I mentioned, I will be showing you guys what my ClinCheck looks like. And if you'd like to skip right ahead to that, I will put in the timestamp either in the video or down in the description box below. Feel free to skip ahead. This tool shows you the movement of your teeth on a tray by tray basis throughout your entire treatment using a 3D model. When you go in to have the impressions taken for your Invisalign, whether that be like the physical putty impressions or the uh, impressions using the scanning tool, that is what your orthodontist will actually send off to Invisalign in order to get this 3D workup of your teeth made. So basically what they do is they take this like um, handheld sort of device, they have you open your mouth and then she goes around to each tooth and she scans. So she holds it as it like takes a bunch of pictures of your teeth. She goes all around in the back, you know, she gets everything. And as she's doing that, it's actually um, putting a 3D model of your teeth onto the screen right next to the dentist chair where you're sitting. So that's really cool. You're seeing everything in real time and then you have this super cool 3D model of your mouth. Those impressions are what your orthodontist sends off to Invisalign and they actually become the basis of your personalized ClinCheck model. From my understanding or experience, ClinCheck is a really excellent tool for patients to see what's going to be happening in their mouths in the next couple of months or years as they progress through their Invisalign treatment. I can see on a tray by tray basis how each of my teeth are going to be moving. So for instance, if I see a really big shift between trays six and seven, I might want to plan ahead and put some painkillers in my purse just in case I might need them. It's also a really great motivator in times when things get a little rough and you're starting to question whether you even want to continue on with your Invisalign journey. You can skip to the end and take a look at, you know, where you are now, where you're eventually going to be, and that can give you the little push that you might need to get through the day. I also just find the whole thing really interesting. Like at any given moment, you could probably find me just on the ClinCheck website just because. From a business standpoint though, it does allow Invisalign to work hand in hand with your orthodontist to tweak the treatment plan. Basically what happens is Invisalign will make that 3D treatment plan, they'll send it back to your orthodontist, and then they can deliberate between themselves to decide whether there's anything that needs to be changed or whether everything is good to go. Um, I do believe that in most cases your orthodontist will also share the ClinCheck with you so that you can deliberate with them to make sure that everything is up to your standards because obviously it's your teeth and you're going to want them to be perfect by the end of the whole treatment. And now what you've all probably clicked on this video to see my ClinCheck. So I did go ahead and do a screen recording. Uh, so I will go ahead and insert that here. My orthodontist sent me a link to access the ClinCheck and an access code. Basically, when you enter that access code into the ClinCheck website and click view treatment, it'll take you here to your personalized animation. Once you're in, you can see the 3D model of your teeth and you'll be able to rotate it any way that you like to see just different views of your teeth. You can also use the bar on the left hand side to zoom in and out. I didn't do that in 
this screen recording, but that's always an option. Along the top, there are a lot of different options that you can choose to see the model from different angles. On the bottom, you can play through the animation, which allows you to see a progression through the trays. You can also skip right to the end and back to the beginning. I think that this shows just how much my teeth are going to be moving over the next couple of years. It's a really drastic difference. For my med and dental students out there, the options at the top here, I'm sure you already know, the maxill button lets you see the maxillary view, which is just the upper jaw, and the mand is a mandibular view, or just the lower jaw view. You can really see the change in the shape of the arch in this view for me, as one of my main issues is that the arch of my jaw is kind of squished in where it's supposed to be more rounded. I'll go ahead and be quiet now and let you guys watch me fiddle with the system a bit. There are a few other options that I didn't show, like the grid and the super. The grid is pretty straightforward, uh, it just shows you a grid over, you know, the regular animation. And then super is for superimpose, which is actually pretty cool. I'll insert this one now. It lets you see both the initial and final positioning at once, with the initial being a sort of shadow that stays in the same spot as you flip through. It's a little hard to visualize when uh, there are teeth overlapping though, so it wasn't really my favorite feature. So now that you've seen my ClinCheck, you're probably wondering how you can get access to yours. Do keep in mind though that this does take a bit of time for Invisalign to put together, so I would say wait at least a couple of weeks between when you get your impressions or scans uh, to ask your orthodontist if your ClinCheck is available, um, because obviously Invisalign does need a bit of time to you know, create that 3D model once they've received those scans from the orthodontist. If you've already had your Invisalign scans completed and it's been a couple of weeks but you still haven't heard anything about a ClinCheck, I would definitely suggest reaching out to your orthodontic office. I actually asked my orthodontist about my ClinCheck before they had even gotten a chance to mention anything about it to me, um, and that's just because I was on YouTube a lot looking at other people's Invisalign videos and it's something that uh, a lot of people had mentioned and I was really really interested to see what mine looked like. So I reached out to my orthodontic office and the receptionist actually told me at the time that my ClinCheck wasn't quite ready. Uh, fast forward 
honestly only a couple of hours and she phoned me back to let me know that they had in fact received the ClinCheck and she emailed me um, all of the login credentials that I need to access it. So that is one thing. Make sure that your email address on file at your orthodontic office is up to date because that's probably how they're going to reach out to you with the information to log in. Now, worst case scenario, like what happened to me, they will probably just tell you that your ClinCheck isn't quite ready yet, but they'll reach out to you once it is. Now, that being said, I'm pretty sure ClinCheck is mainly a tool that's used between your orthodontic office and Invisalign, not so much between um, the orthodontic office and the patient. Uh, so I would definitely recommend talking to your orthodontic office just to find out what their policy is about that ClinCheck tool. Some might not be willing to release them to patients, but I don't see any reason why they wouldn't be. Uh, at the very least, your orthodontist will probably Probably let you see the ClinCheck video even if they don't send you a link to access it yourself. So we've made it to the end of the video. Thank you guys so so much for watching. If you have any other questions feel free to leave them in the comment section below. I hope this was really helpful for you guys and as always feel free to like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe if you'd like to keep up with me and see my future Invisalign videos and I will see you guys in the next one.